Hello, I'm Morgan from Irrelevant Shorts and today I'm going to be showing you how to connect your PC or laptop to the internet via your phone's 3G or GPRS connection which is basically your mobile data thing if you didn't know that. So, say for example you've, you're not in range, you've, you're out, you've got your laptop with you but you're not in range of any Wi-Fi networks which for this I'll be simulating by taking out my 3G no, no, not 3G. Wi-Fi adapter for my PC because it's upstairs, nowhere near a line. So um, I've got my phone, which is a LG KC910, and I've connected it to this cable, which leads all the way to the computer. That's all connected and stuff with all the other crap that shouldn't really be there, but whatever. And if I unlock that, this touchscreen phone, resistive. Maybe I'll do a review of it at some point. If I look in the corner. There we go, can't really see it, but it says 3G+, plus, which basically, which is HSPA, which is just slightly faster 3G. This is no new phone, this is like 2008, but yeah, it's got 3G capability, so it'll work fine. Okay, so here you can see, have no internet whatsoever, there's none at all, only really what I've used before, which I'm going to use now. I'm going to use a program called Internet Kit, which is part of the LG PC suite, which I can't get to work. So I just went into the uh, all the files of the PC suite and ripped them out and found this, which is what I wanted really. So if I double click this, this comes up. And this, I'll delete this so I can go through it with you. And what I can do from here is I can add a configuration for my phone. So if I click add, go to manual so I can choose my country, which I'm in the UK, as you might be able to tell. Um, if I choose my mobile provider, which is Tesco, it will be a list of all the ones. This should be what you have. If not, you can always input your settings. But I don't think there's any here that aren't, like, there. That's all of them, I think. So that's it. Autumn, you, you click on whichever mobile network provider you're on, and then that will bring up all the settings, the dial-up settings, like the username, password, dial number, that sort of thing. You press save, and then if I click on that, and I press, bear in mind, still got no internet connection now, press connect, for it to work. There we go, the internet has been connected, it says. Okay now, so if I go to the bottom, uh, here we go. Give it a minute. Whilst it says things. There we go. Oh, it's connected now. And to prove it, I'll load up Firefox, which is my browser of choice, don't you know? There we go. That's that. Load up our, our YouTube channel. Just remember to uh, like, subscribe, you know, that sort of thing. There you go, that's that fully loaded over 3G connection. It's all, it's pretty fast actually, it's sort of like three quarters the speed of Wi Fi, well, my Wi Fi anyway. So, I'll show you our Mac antivirus software, which is um, available on our channel, don't you know? Click on that, give it a few seconds, and there we go, that's loaded already. There it goes. That's probably quicker than my Wi-Fi, if anything. But yeah, with this, what you've got to be careful of is look how much data I've used already, and that's loading video. That's 2.27 megabytes, which doesn't seem like much. But if you're gonna, if you are gonna use this to watch a lot of videos, which I don't recommend, just make sure you either watch how much data has been used, or you have a very large data allowance. 3 is very good for this, they'll give you, I think, a gig of internet in their contracts, which are quite cheap, and in some of them they give you unlimited, but I don't know if that's actually unlimited or just a few gig and a big price tag. So, yeah, there you go. It's connected with 3G. It says on there. Little computery logo thing, a phone behind it, 
this thing will ever actually autofocus, but I don't think it will. And I'm recording this on my iPod 4G, which I said I'd get in my iPod jailbroken feature review. I'm going to do a new one of those because I've got 5.9 on this now, so magically new things. But yeah, there we go. So that's how to connect your PC or laptop to the internet via your 3G connection. There we go. If I disconnect now to not use all my data allowance. Yes, yes, yes. Click that, click that. Click that. Thank you very much for watching. Oh, Morka. And remember to like, rate, subscribe, all that sort of stuff. And thank you to Paul. Oh, background's changed. Okay. So, yeah. If you've got any questions, leave them in the comments below. Thank you very much. Bye.